So you know, you've just you've just come off stage. How do you feel? I feel good. I feel relieved. Um, but yeah, it's it's such a privilege to be able to talk here. So I feel really good. And um, what kind of training have you had in music? Like, how did you sort of get into the industry? Uh, for me, it's it's self-taught. So I'm like an electronic bedroom producer. That's how I started, and just kind of learning along the way. So I think the use of the internet for me was a pivotal kind of thing for my career and that's, I think if you were to sum me up, that would be it. How do you think the music scene is for young people here? I think Australia especially is, is really good. I mean, uh, the, the music scene in, in general is quite young and I feel like institutes like Triple J, uh, FBI uh, and other bigger ones really kind of encourage creativity at a young age. And you see, you know, kids are getting younger and younger these days making music. So I feel like it definitely is there and uh, Australia is really putting it into the youth that they can pursue these kind of things. Uh, I feel like a lot of people are, uh, feel like they want to be creative, but they don't really, they don't think their ideas are any good and they're a little bit nervous about putting themselves out there. Have you ever felt like that? And if so, how do you get over that sort of self-doubt? I think, yeah, I, I, I have those feelings all the time. Even now, when I think you're constantly comparing yourself to others, no matter how uh, how many strides you make or how big of a name you make for yourself, there's always going to be a group of people, one person that you look to and say, I wish I could be that person or get to that level. You can't fight the natural feelings you have as an artist, and you really need to curb those feelings and to say, well, I'm just, you can only do the best you can. And I feel like if you aspire to be like someone else, are you going to be happy with that product? I'm like, are you going to be happy with the steps you've taken to make that product and you're not because you haven't done it from your heart. I sound like Dr. Phil but, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we're yeah. On yeah we're on a couch. <laughs> Did you have any um, any tips for sort of budding musicians? Yeah I think just to let things happen naturally. I feel like a lot of young musicians or creatives really want things to happen overnight but that's not really how it works. I feel like you really have to put in work um, and you really have to hustle to get anywhere in this world uh, and that doesn't have a negative connotation it just means that you just have to work harder you know and um, again put out music and things that you like and don't try and cater for any kind of uh, scene or genre just just to be yourself and you'll see you know over, over time by being yourself and working hard you'll just you'll get somewhere eventually you know what I mean it's bound to happen